Hey guys, uh, welcome back to another Fitbit quickie. On this one we are going to take a look at uh, automatic crafting table from Buildcraft 3. Uh, let's see how you can craft it. Uh, for this you need uh, four wooden gears. You make wooden gears by placing sticks like that. Okay. And uh, you place wooden gears like that on the sides and one crafting table in the middle. So this is a simple and really cheap recipe. Okay, so what does automatic crafting table do? Well, it f functions like a normal crafting table. It has the same uh, graphical user interface, but it will do it automatically if we provide it uh, the ingredients that it needs. So for example, torches. No, normally you would craft them like that and with the automatic crafting table you can automate it. So if I place let's say two uh, sticks here, two coals in there. Oh sorry let's do it like this. So you set the recipe you want to make in here and when you pull uh, the items out from this uh, machine with uh, engines uh, it will always keep the recipe in here, so it doesn't uh, lose the recipe that you set. Okay. Uh, next we need to turn on today, and uh, let's set up a little example. And I need the chest also. So let's pipe. Uh, let's say that we want to make uh, torches automatically with this one. Uh, we need to have a redstone engine to pull out the items from the uh, uh, from the automatic crafting table and then a wooden transport pipe and a couple of cobblestone to cobblestone pipes to connect to the chest. Uh, I'm going to add an annotation about all of these so that you can see how they work and how you can craft them. And then let's uh, give the, the redstone engine a signal. Okay, as you can see, the one stick and one coal disappeared from here, and there they are. The torches, I mean. <coughs> and it doesn't pull out this. And if we check this uh, chest, there should be four tor torches. Okay, so that's just an example. You can do whatever you want. For example, make crafting tables out of it, if you want. Or anything, or bowls. Ah, sorry, <laughs> I need to add two of each, like that. And speaking of bowls, uh, you can put this... Uh, oh yeah, and uh, that, that was I, I was supposed to say. You don't need to uh, set up items like this in here. You can add a chest next to it and throw the items in there. And the automatic question table pulls out items from the chest and makes the uh, recipe from that as you can see or if you want to make the uh, torches let's set the recipe here ingredients here and uh, there we go and also if you want I had the poles in here, so let's set up so that we will always provide it that we give this enough wood and enough, enough mushrooms, we get uh, uh, food for lifetime. So let's set up the recipe for mushroom stew in here. Then we need to another automatic crafting table to make the uh, bowls for us. So let let's set the recipe in here like that and draw out the items from there into this automatic crafting table so you can uh, pipe items into it also okay let's throw in some planks to get the bowls okay and I'm going to sh set up an another chest here to contain the mushrooms <clears throat> Sorry about that. 
And as you can see, it will draw out the items, uh, planks in here, make the bowls. And this crafting table is going to have the bowls in here and get the mushrooms from this chest and make the stew for us. So you can combine these easily. Or you could have yeah, one chest where you dump all your items and then lead the items that this one needs into here. So that was about it about the uh, crafting table. These are really handy if you want to automate stuff. And uh, well, who doesn't want you if you are playing? <laughs> if you are playing Pete the Beast. So that's it. Thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you on the next one.